this is going to be a small video on function generator and oscilloscope. So um, this is a function generator um, built in LabVIEW. Um, you can see here the block diagram. So this is the block diagram of, of the function generator we just saw. This, this part is the function generator. And here, these are for the oscilloscope, or and these are the knobs to control the time division, voltage division, and these are the fun uh, case functions for writing the waveform to a file, and all um, and also this the same stuff for writing uh, or to copying the image to a file. So let's see this. So in this function generator, you can generate five types of waveforms, sine wave, triangular, sawtooth, square, and DC. So depending on which one, you, which waveform you select, the corresponding LED will glow here. This shows the peak-to-peak -peak amplitude, frequency, trigger. It, you can either trigger it on or off. Frequency from 20 to 20 kilohertz is the multiplier. And this is for the fine tuning. You can add phase. You can also add add amplitude, offsets, duty cycle. This duty cycle works only for the square waves. You can you can either add or or turn it off the the noise. You can add three types of noise, uniform, Gaussian, and binomial. Um, this cursor will change depending on which noise you choose. For uniform, it's noise amplitude. For Gaussian, it's, it is going to be a, a standard deviation. For bin binomial noise, it is going to be um, a trial probability. You can adjust the time division, you can adjust the voltage division. In addition to that, you can save the graph in JPEG, PNG, or BMP file. You can also export the waveform values to an Excel file, text file, or a bin binary file. Uh, the record time will show the time you have um, recorded the signal into the file. This the on and uh, this the off button. Y you can see both the graphs here: a waveform and the frequency transform of the waveform. So let's start this function generator. So as you see, I have selected the sign. So sign. <coughs> Sign LED has grown, grown. Um, it's zero zero because there is no frequency, nothing. So let's increase the frequency. First, this one amplitude. Oh, this is the uh, Fourier transform. So let's go to the wave and let's in increase the frequency and amplitude time. Okay, adjust the voltage division, increase, let's go to 5, 6 kilohertz, and let's start the triggering. You, you can increase the amplitude and adjust the voltage division. So, or you can add more frequency, or you can add phase, or you can add offset, or increase the offset. You can turn it on the Gaussian noise. Right now it's uniform. So, let's increase the noise Gaussian. And corresponding 
a Fourier transform. Now, when I change the frequency, uh, you see the corresponding tone um, gets shifted in, in frequency domain. Um, you can also adjust the time. Let's turn this off. Um, Let's say we want to save this graph into uh, in, in some place. So let's save this graph, um, JPEG or PNG. Uh, let's save in JPEG. Save file and ask you where you want to save the file. Um, I already know. So in test one, and I say okay. I saved. Let's check this graph here. Yeah. Test one. Check it. So here is the graph. Um, you can also export this waveform into um, some file. First, change this to triangular square, uh, sawtooth square wave. In the square wave, you can adjust the duty cycle. So right now it's 50%. You can either increase it to 80, 90, based on the requirements, or you can decrease. And this is the Fourier transform of square wave. Let's say you want to save and export these files into an Excel file. So export. And I want to export it here. Square one and save. See, it's um, it's it started the time. Let's say stop. Go and check this one out. I think my Excel is not working. Oh, that's here. So this is the um, square wave. And you can see um, it's easy to recognize it. It's minus four to two point something, two point eight, then again minus four, again two, again minus four. So you now we can say it's a square wave. So yeah. And so this is the simple function generator and oscilloscope. Um, I have attached the VI to this um, below. I mean, I have given the link to download the VI of this function generator. You can download it, and if you want, you can modify it by. As, as you want. So, good luck. Bye.